What's up guys? This is Pro Warriors. We might have just entered a new era. What's being called the first ever Xbox emulator for Android is finally here. Imagine playing legendary Xbox classics right from your phone. Sounds insane, right? But before you smash that download button, you need to hear my shocking findings about this so-called Xanite emulator that just dropped today. I'm going to install it, test it with actual Xbox original games, and reveal whether this is the breakthrough we've all been waiting for or just hype. A few days ago, Xanite announced that Xanite V 0.1 APK would be released on August 10th, but that date came and went. Then this morning, I finally got the notification. Xanite Phi 0.1 is here. With excitement, I downloaded the APK, ready to test Xbox Original and Xbox 360 games on Android. Unfortunately, it crashed over and over again. Before blaming my phone, I checked the official requirements. For Xbox Original, it required Snapdragon 855, Exynos 990, Dimensity 1000 or better, 4 gigabytes RAM and 8 gigabytes plus recommended. For Xbox 360, it required Snapdragon 888, Exynos 2200, Dimensity 8300 or better, 8 gigabytes RAM and 12 gigabytes plus recommended. Graphics, OpenGL 3.2 and Vulkan coming soon. Android 9 and below not supported. It doesn't seem to be a specs hungry emulator and my device meets all the listed requirements, so the issue is clearly with the app itself. Since I'm an official tester, I reported the crash to the devs. They provided a mega link with a fixed build and updated the GitHub repo. If you're on Android 14 or 15, the GitHub APK will still crash, so use the mega link instead. The emulator feels similar to other new Android projects like APS 3E or RPC SX. It has two main sections, Xbox Original and Xbox 360 plus a settings tab with only language and theme options. No advanced settings yet. I don't mind if it can run games. Time to try a game. I started with the Xbox 360 section. Zenite doesn't come with games, but it does include BIOS files, so you don't need to add them. It supports ISO format games. I added one, and it appeared in the dashboard. But when I clicked on it, Zenite acted like it was going to run the game, then nothing happened. The dev members explained why games might not work in the emulator, and pointed out that it could be because Zenite doesn't support standard ISO files, but requires the XISO format instead. So if the game is in ISO format, you have to convert it using a converter to XISO. However, it still isn't working for me. So, can Xanite run Xbox Original or Xbox 360 games right now? The answer is no. This version is basically a UI showcase. It looks like an emulator, but it doesn't actually emulate anything. I have no idea why the developer chose to release it in this state. Releasing a non-functional build gives toxic people the perfect excuse to attack the project and spread negativity. The devs say we should wait for version 0.3 for a stable release that can run actual Xbox games. Even though it's not functional yet, I'm still excited about Xanite's potential. I'm hoping the developers prove the haters wrong and turn this into a real working Xbox emulator for Android. But until then, I don't recommend trying it. If you want more info in the future or love gaming emulation videos, make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Take care.